Good morning and thanks for tuning in. This morning we're going to Wilson's Point in Bear Machine, New Brunswick. I'm going with Melanie and Jackie this morning. We're all going together as a trio. And we're going to take over Mare Machine. And while we're there, we're going to stop for at a few places and show you, you know, what it's like along the way. And we're also going to grab a bite to eat at uh, the most amazing German bakery that we used to uh, eat at. German bakery. Mel and I lived there for two years, and I missed that German bakery. So much. See what German. Setting off on our little adventure. Alright, here we go. Time to order. Hi, uh, I'm going to get two medium bowl coffees. Two medium bowl coffees, anything in them? Yes, there's gonna be creamy white chocolate, hazelnut, cane sugar. Sure, anything else? One cream in each as well. Alright, you can go on out. Moose! Yeah, we get those around here. The whole stereotype that there's moose all over Canada. Um, the only time I, I saw moose was in a zoo. That's the only time I saw moose. But you guys had a weird trip once. When there. was the only time you saw a moose? At the zoo. At the zoo? Yeah, at the zoo. I, I've seen... Um, this is me thinking back. I'm 35 years old. I shouldn't have said that. I'm going to cut that out. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I've seen maybe... Four, five moose on the highway um, in my life. Was it that one time that when you went down by to Mir Bishi when you were still living there and you had like a moose, a bear, and what else? Did you it was a, a bear and two, a bear, a moose, and a deer. They were all gunning for your car that night. <laughs> it's a hill. Put your hands up, we're going down a hill. Woo! To show you this this is like super cool what the f oh oh yeah i remember check that out that is so cool yeah i bet look how cool this is wow wow Under the bridge. I used to walk this bridge all the time. It takes 30 minutes to walk both ways. I lost a lot of weight walking on that bridge. So here we are at, our, at the, the German bakery, at the Napin Bakery and uh, and Cafe. This is where we used to come and buy the uh, snowballs. They're called. Uh, they had the most amazing desserts. They're, they taste really, really good. Not too sweet. Um, just really good quality food. So we're gonna go inside and cross your fingers for us. Hopefully, there's uh, some snowballs left. And I see Mel's like, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Square, which is really good. I tried it before. Amazing. It's a sea monster. It's like super delicious. It does look good. I know. Mine's the port. Raspberry cream for filling. Port. And this here map shows the. Everybody came from Vincent. Yep, people all around the world came to eat here.
we're going into Middle Island, the Middle Island Irish Historical Park. Pretty windy as you can see. We've been here before a few times, Mel and I, we used to come uh, walk here for, well just for exercise. There's a nice trail that circles the entire island and a lot of kids and, and families swim on the other side is almost like a little miniature beach there and oh, there's a wharf yeah there's a little uh, a dock right there on the side or in the front over there where you can where kids jump off of that they tell you not to because kids listen to every rule so here it says if your girlfriend poops pick it up don't sleep here and don't ride a bike so nice park you can do picnics there's random crippled people on crutches there they have the Irish flag, I believe it is. Yeah. Poor Melanie. It's too bad. It's gonna take her a long time. And at the end of it all, Danny's gonna have to piggyback me. Look, no hands! <laughs> <laughs> not a lot though, because I'm, it's hard. It's not very heavy, but. Watch those words, I think. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Standing in the middle of a hedge field or whatever, a hedge that's shaped in the shape of a uh, three leaf clover? Yeah, a three leaf clover. You can't really tell from here, but uh, that's what it is. So, this Celtic cross was erected in memory of the Irish immigrants that landed here in 1847, and uh, they were sent here because they had typhus fever. Basically, if you had that fever, you were sent here to this island to die. <laughs> Here's from my point of view on Danny's back. You're choking. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> and you're squeezing. Sorry. There. <laughs> I'm sure my, I look like a peacock right now. Here it goes out into the ocean. Yeah, that literally leads out to the ocean. Yeah. I'm not sure if it's exactly right there, but it does lead out it, to the ocean. Yeah. So that's where the big boats came in to bring in the dying the, people. Yeah, the sick people. Typhus fever. We're gonna head back to the car right now and we're gonna go back to Moncton. We may or may not film in the car, but we'll see you when we get back home. Adventure. <laughs>